Hey, it's dark outside, so I have to have my light on. I haven't used this thing in a while, but uh, it's my Friday. Got off a little early today. Um, super excited because got some basketball to watch tonight. Gonna record, um, and then when I get home. Gonna edit and then upload it. Uh, I think there's another there's another game tomorrow. Also, I don't remember where that's at. I don't know if it's here or somewhere else. I can't remember. But anyways, um, so my weekend is going to be pretty much filled with doing that. Uh, also, I have uh, I have some other projects that I'm. I have to need I need to get started on but it's it's gonna be like <laughs> a while before I get it all done uh, so what I'm trying to do to make it not complicated or I don't know kind of messing myself up it is I, I want to be able to go in with at least three or four of the, the kids uh, this year on, on the team and, and go through and, and grab all the clips from this year so far. Um, and I know that's gonna be a big ordeal for me at least because it, it's a lot. And then I don't know if, if you've ever attempted uh, video editing at all. Uh, you kinda have to be, I don't wanna say built for it, but uh, you, you have to sustain a lot of uh, a lot of fatigue because staring at a screen, looking at a video, you know, having to go through it over and over again, sometimes having to like redo something because you messed up. I mean, there's just, there's a lot of variables, uh, but one thing is, is for sure, it's, it's a very tiring, it's a very, um, I guess it's a good way for me to be able to get into a workflow and and things I guess become a little bit more simpler as uh, as it's being a, a repetitious thing so in that aspect I, I really don't mind but having to spend like say I don't know an hour for one video I, I it could possibly turn into two hours um, or even three hours depending on you know how many clips I need and what I'm doing with that and uh, what the last the last project I, I did it took me like two or three hours just to get a picture cut it you know cut the the person out of the picture uh, by hand because I had to zoom it all the way in um, and then find backgrounds whatnot things that mesh with it well that that I wanted to do so it's 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 a little bit longer process than it kind of seems like if you're looking at it uh, on the outside because you're just seeing the, the finalized product um, and that's what I really enjoy is just getting it not done but like all the steps in between and then maybe changing things up and not like doing the same thing over and over again because that I think that becomes boring uh, just like doing the same things over and over again so like adding a little bit of I don't know a picture clip or video or something um, along with what I'm doing it I think it's going to help me. I, I haven't started doing that, but it's always been on the the back of my mind uh, because I, I want to incorporate a lot of things that I I've been teaching myself, picking up, uh, watching from other people. And it's not like I study a lot. I don't I don't sit there and uh, a whole bunch of times uh, unless I need a need to get a different I guess perspective on on things but for the most part it's all straightforward when you're video editing it's like you have the video <clears throat> you find what you need cut it out or, or whatever that you're doing 
Uh, the rest of it, though, like, I don't really do too much. Like, I, I want to be able to, like, start getting into, like, when a, when a video is going, like, so adding, like, um, an, an outline or a trace or something as that video is playing. That's something I really want to uh, learn and, and then, like I said, incorporate in my videos. But once once my kids get out of school and uh, they're not playing sports or whatnot, I'm, I'm going to have to, you know, use these things that I'm learning now on other projects that I'm going to do. And those other projects are probably going to be, you know, like the, the 3D printer or... Uh, building a computer or a system or um maybe even smaller things i don't know but it, it, it's it's going to going to go a long ways from what i learned now uh to when my kids get out of school and they're you know not in the house or anything anymore so it's just me and my wife alone pretty much uh i'm gonna to have to well i don't think it's gonna be alone i think parents are going to be there but I'm going to have to learn a lot of things in the meantime so I don't have to I guess focus on a lot of that later on I don't want to say it's going to get harder to learn a lot of this technology because it's not it's it's pretty simple I I watch a video you pretty much learn the gist of things and then you go from there. You add your own spark, flare, whatever you want to call it. And uh, yeah, that's about it. But there's a lot more to it with the with uh, all the different uh, video editors. Like with the two that I use normally, I really don't go in depth with all of it because I don't use all of the features. But uh, I know that if I want to, you know, I guess not say master, but guess get a lot better than I am now to where I'm faster and quicker and with uh, you know getting an idea set in place and then and going from that idea and, and then creating whatever I need to create um, eventually though if I ever get anything started with this channel and anything ever happens Eventually, though, I, I will have someone else doing the video editing because I'm not, I'm not going to be like this top-notch dude doing it. So it, it's going to be lackluster, to say the least, honestly, because, I mean, with these vlogs, I really don't do anything ever, uh, and I probably should be, I mean, I should be putting my, like, intro or uh, outro or something uh, but I don't do any of that because I like the rawness of it I like that it's just me and it's just me adding whatever it is that I'm I'm adding to the, the content so um, as time goes on though it's things are gonna change as this channel and the things that I I post are gonna change their not always going to be the same and that's that's what I really want to get to is is not an end goal it, it is uh, an end to the beginning because I, I always need to change and I always need to uh, focus on my future and, and not just what I'm trying to do presently um, and that has a lot to do with just failing learning and failing and, and posting things that may never work or uh, saying the things that probably will never get watched but it, it's something to to do even for say whoever's watching this right now posting any type of video just to get it out there so that way you're building up your confidence and you're building up you know I guess I guess I could say a catalog of things that you can go through and say, hey, I did this or said this, uh, which I probably won't do a lot of myself, but you could do that. You could use a lot of this stuff as a reference uh, for later. So anyways, it is time. I'll talk to you later. Have a good weekend.